2011 was a big year for sports headlines, not just on the sports page, but on the uh, front page as well. So what were the key uh, PR learnings from 2011? Well, I think one of the first areas to focus on is obviously crisis communications. Is 2011 served as an example of what not to do. Penn State bumbling their story, Syracuse caught in the crosshairs, University of Miami, um, you know, put their feet to the fire in terms of their NCA investigation. In a lot of cases, people were not getting out in front of the story, they weren't controlling the headlines, and from there it just steamrolled and it turned into the mess. Another big thing in uh, 2011 was the uh, idea of taking something from a niche audience to a mainstream audience. Certainly one of the best examples is UFC. Uh, President Dana White, he originally invested $2 million with his partners and he turned that into a $1 billion company. So how did they do it and why was 2011 big? They established a brand. They didn't apologize for that brand. They kept the message the same. When, upon building the brand, what they did is they created greater awareness by making their fighters accessible to their fans, whether it be through social media, through new broadcast shows that they created, through different partnerships and uh, promotions and sponsorships with companies. They were out there touching their fans and really creating great PR for the brand uh, in a way that felt real to those who followed the sport. So we're here in a new year. What's uh, What should we be looking out for in 2012? Well, I think one of the biggest things uh, to look out for is sports turning into big business. I mean, sure, we're already there, but when I say sports turning into big business, I'm really talking about the PR side of that too. People are obsessed with sports, and just like celebrity, they want the latest news, and the juicier, the better. So they have to handle themselves like a big business. That's certainly number one. And number two, something that goes beyond just sports and really everything is technology whether it be social media whether it be new digital platforms and so forth it's going to continue to expand in 2012 teams have to utilize those channels to communicate with those fan their fans so though this might be a, a bit of a corny old sports adage given you know the key areas of focus on in 2012 i think this is now more applicable than ever and when it comes to sports and that is it's not whether you win or lose but it's how you play the game and that's certainly going to be important when it comes to public relations and marketing uh, in, in the upcoming year.